Going Daytona with one bike, a 2008 G6R 600. First time at Daytona, so it was just trying to work on the times, get the settings. It was uh, the bike was a little erratic in uh, race one, and I knew I could run with those, the top guys. It was good in Daytona. You know, it was great. We come out second place. I think we're 21 points behind Tomas Porta. Um, going into the next round. Dave Ashley from Ant Racing. I'll you know, put a big shout out to him and my dad, making us look, you know, professional as professional as we can be. You know, Dave just really stepped up this year and took over the team owner of uh, Ant Racing. You know, that's how we got the season rolling. We got a lot of great sponsors behind us this year, and the program is getting really solid. We got our first sponsor, which is PEI, Pittsburgh Electrical Insulation. Tech Mounts was another financial sponsor. We couldn't thank them guys enough. Shock T Warriors helping out kids with uh, board games and the heroes and you know got the call late star school and national guard wanted to do something so you know I, first i can't thank jp enough you know Stephen Hand from national guard and all our troops you know we'll just uh, keep working and uh, you know off days we'll be working on podiums and good days we'll be winning so that's our whole game plan this year is just to get all the points we can and uh, come out to the star schools and learn from jp every second you know, it's just this learning curve is, is tough, so everybody's pushing the limit so much, we're just, I keep trying to find the way how I can ride to make, you know, to find, to start making the limit. So it's, it's tough, I'm learning a lot, but overall, a great weekend so far. I like the track, I love it man, it's uh, really fun, flow it, it's got a lot of stuff that a lot of tracks doesn't have, elevation, you know what I mean, a lot of G outs, it's great. Got crushed by a lap today, but it's all good, it's racing, and yeah, he went by me and him. I should have easily just went, went through and blocked you know what I mean? Pull, try to grab that gap. You know, he was very smart by doing that. He was riding really aggressive the whole time. And uh, I think you'll see a little different, a little different James Rispoli tomorrow. Tomorrow's a new day. Bringing points back. We're always making points. It's, it's the best. It's always good. You know what I mean? Now we can kind of control a little bit. You know what I mean? So if we can control a little bit, uh, it's good. We're in, hopefully in some people's heads right now.
a lot of motivation, good handful of points. We really try not to let the championship pressure us or in any way, so we're kind of just coming into here like any other race, you know, just trying to get the podiums and the wins. So the girl off went out and he went down, got down to the 25-1, and so I threw my ring on and really tried to throw down and, you know, I gave it all my best and, you know, we ended up to do a tenth more and put her up on top of the pole and get a handful of points. So, you know, it, this is it's a really great weekend so far. So I just can't wait to get this first one out of the way and see if we can wrap it up so we can just have it all go back and tomorrow just go have some fun. into this wasn't really you know it was push hard but still be smart and that's what we did today we pushed hard got away you know like I said we don't want to be in that meat grinder you know back there and uh, we got away me and girl off he went through I sat behind him did some really good times watched him learned and uh, just pretty much stalked him for tomorrow um, wrapped up a championship it just feels amazing you know first pro champion it's you know unbelievable. Just it hasn't really sunk in yet, you know. So just really just hanging out and getting ready for tomorrow. Cause it's gonna throw down and see if we can you know take him down. Man, it was a pretty crazy race uh, from the start. You know, I didn't get the whole shot the way I wanted to, but I made quick work with Gillum, and uh, you know I just rode a smart race. I tried to. Uh, just do a comfortable pay, something that I knew I had some uh, tire left in the end if I needed it. So it wasn't nothing crazy. I did 24 9. Uh, so I knew what we got down there and we'd break off some of the stragglers. Uh, girl off came by, you know, dripping by down the front straightaway. So this time I wasn't going to let him go. I stuck on him. He was a little bit faster in some spots, but I really stuck on him hard. You know, coming into the last area, I was really stuck on him. and. Uh, Got a little greedy with the gas and uh, almost ran in the back of them, but you know, got back by him there and then uh, still just rode a smart race, a real smart race on really riding some defensive lines down down the long straightaways where I knew he could easily come back by. But uh, you know, overall, it, it was good, man. I set the pace and uh, I did what I wanted to do, and you know, anybody who came by I was going straight back by, so it was good. Oh, Monster's been behind me 110 percent. Uh, you know, they brought me on board this year and uh, it's been great. They, they help me out with everything, you know what I mean? It's, it's a part of a family, you know, those guys over there, they really take care of me, my autograph sheets to, you know what I mean, to Monster Energy, to, you know, Rider Development Fund. You know, like, it's just been so awesome working with these guys and I hope to have, you know, just years upon years with these guys and, you know, really be a part of the team and, and uh, you know, try to win a couple more for them.